This is a USB detector. It measures the current and the voltage at a USB port. That's to give you an idea of the size. And like many USB pens, it has a lid in the top to protect the USB end. I'm going to use it to check the current and voltage on a power bank. So there's the USB pen. I have to stick it in between the two items. That's the lead that goes to the iPhone. So I'm sticking it in between the iPhone and the power bank. Now that port there is rated at 5 volts, 1 amp, so it'll be interesting to see what voltage and current I actually get. And indeed I do get 5 volts. The current starts off quite high at half an amp, but it very quickly falls to um, between 0.2 and 0.3 of an amp. You'll actually see in a moment it falls to 0.28 of an amp, but I left it and it continued to fall to about 0.23 of an amp. There's a second port that's rated at double the current, 2.1 of an amp, so I'm going to use it to check that, and indeed I still do get 5 volts, but it doesn't pull out 2.1 of an amp, it pulls out again roughly 0 0.23, 0 0.24 of an amp. So that's interesting because what it shows is that it doesn't matter which end I plug my iPhone into, I still get the same current out of it. I used to think that if I accidentally plugged it into the 2.1 amp port rather than the 1 amp port that I would fry my iPhone, but in actual fact my iPhone controls the current. And there's the two ports on the power bank showing that the top one is 1 amp and the bottom one is 2.1 of an amp. Thank you for watching and I hope you found this helpful.